Kyle Henderson, Bama Football on YouTube with a breaking video update. This is about Keelan Russell winning the Elite 11 MVP award, okay? Many years ago, I used to work for the Elite 11. I have a lot of experience in this realm. Brian Stump, the executive director, did a lot for me in my career. This video is not about me, it's about Keelan Russell in the Elite 11. The Elite 11, so many quarterbacks have gone through the Elite 11. You look at all the NFL quarterbacks, not only have they helped these quarterbacks develop in college, but also beyond that, all right? And winning this award is monumental. I think obviously it's gonna make him a five-star, uh, bump, bump, but he earned that on his own merit, right? You look at the pathway of Keelan Russell, he was committed to SMU, Coach Kalen DeBoer, Jamarcus Shepard, Nick Sheridan saw this bright quarterback that they wanted within their commitment class of 2025. And you've seen things starting to snowball after Keelan Russell's commitment, right? You get three offensive linemen. This is a monumental weekend for Alabama football recruiting. Keelan Russell winning this award says a lot about the trajectory of the next wave of the Alabama quarterback. And we all understand that the quarterback right now here in Alabama is Jalen Milrow. You look at the quarterbacks behind him, Ty Simpson, Dylan Lonergan, Austin Mack. This is a quarterback mecca. Look at the transition of quarterbacks uh, since Lane Kiffin, right, left, and the quarterbacks that we've covered over the last several years. Bryce Young, the number one pick in the NFL draft. Tua Tungvaluwa, Jalen Hurts, look what he's doing in the NFL, right? You look at Matt Jones, now you look at Jalen Milrow. These quarterbacks have been phenomenal, and props, props, my goodness, to Keelan Russell. This is a monumental award that he won today. I'm really excited about it, and I think it also catapults Alabama in terms of the recruiting momentum that you're going to continue to see. By the way, you know where this is at, right? This is Innisfree, all right? I'm about to meet with the boys. Um, here at 5 p.m. But I think it catapults this weekend. You saw it on social media. Mo Linquist said, this weekend is going to be monumental. He said legendary. And a legendary, monumental, whatever adjective that you want to use to describe it. Look at the guys that are coming in. Justice Terry, he's coming in. You have uh, Kalik Lockett, who just left after visiting Alabama, the five-star offensive uh, wide receiver out of Texas. Well, where is Keelan Russell from? He is from Texas. Um, you look at um, Dejon Lee, the most talented corner you could arguably say in the country. He's from California. I talked about this on my morning show. There are currently four commitments from the state of California. Alex Ospro, the punter, right? You have uh, Jackson Lloyd, who just jumped on board. You have um, Chuck McDonald, right? And you have Abdul Sanders, who will also be here this weekend. Coach Kalen DeBoer, has something really special going. If you're an Alabama fan, continue to savor it. Recruiting hasn't slowed down in the slightest, and uh, this weekend is about to be popping. You just saw that Dawson Merritt also has been predicted to commit to Alabama. I know a bunch of Nebraska fans upset about that, uh, but man, just props. I'm so happy for uh, Keelan Russell to win the Elite 11 award. There's some talented guys within that group, man. You saw it, right? You saw it. Um, so again, coming to you from Innisfree, here in Tuscaloosa, Alabama. Props to Keelan Russell. Give a roll tide inside the comment box. I'll be back as news happens right here on Bama Football on YouTube.